So let's start off with my forex hunts. I don't think my forex hunts is coming back, but I could be wrong. I just haven't been going with the flow with my forex funds that much anymore because I've just accepted that if firms do something wrong, they will possibly be gone. And I think that's good because it shines a positive light into the industry. That is, if you are trying to actually just mess with traders or doing something that is illegal on the back end you are gone and i think that that's fair just like it happens with any other industry then on social media i saw people saying the same with true forex funds when it's extremely not the same true forex funds has a different problem than my forex funds because true forex funds they're not leaving true forex funds had a complicated issue but it was based on metatrader it wasn't based on anything important legal while funded engineer on the other end is still yet to be seen because funded engineer was accused of fraud that is a big accusation that will take a little bit longer to figure out but let's stay with true forex funds for a second what happened with true forex funds was that they lost their metatrader 5 license so true forex funds was either using a white label broker or they were using a third party that was providing the white label broker but their license is actually only the metatrader 5 license which means that the solution is simple but it isn't at the same time because the solution the simple solution is that they will have to come up with a new platform either dx trade c trader whatever it is true forex funds will have to change it can't be metatrader 5 anymore and we'll see this happening more and more we'll talk about that after